this is a simple problem. It's sine of step cos x upon 1 plus x. Step, you know, is greatest integer function. Greatest integer function. Here, cos x is under the step function. First of all, we have to understand about cos x. Like what? If you see cos x, cos x graph goes like this. It is it is to be understood like this. So if you see this cos x graph at 0 it is becoming 1 at 0 it is becoming 1 why we are talking about 0 only because x is tending to 0 here we are interested about the value of uh, step cos x here that's the reason why you have to see x tends to 0 minus and x tends to 0 plus both the values we have to see now whether x is tending to 0 plus or 0 minus this is 0 minus if you see this this will be like this and 0 plus also like this that is what i mean to say here for 0 plus or 0 minus this is 0 minus this is 0 plus. Whether it is 0 plus or 0 minus, it is, it is moving to, just you can see, it is moving to, it is moving to a value, it is moving to a value which is less than 1, which is less than 1 in both the cases, less than 1 in the both the cases. That means cos x is less than 1. That means lies between, you have to understand, it lies between 0 less than cos x is less than 1. Implies step of cos x obviously becomes 0. Step of cos x obviously becomes 0. And thereby this limit becomes limit of sine 0 upon 1 plus 0 as x tends to 0 becomes 0.